Our task must be to free ourselves. By widening our circle of compassion to embrace all living creatures and the whole of nature and its beauty. Wisdom is not a product of schooling but of the lifelong attempt to acquire it. Only a life lived for others is a life worthwhile. Few are those who see with their own eyes and feel with their own hearts. Imagination is the highest form of research. However rare true love may be, it is less so than true friendship. I live in that solitude which is painful in youth, but delicious in the years of maturity. God does not play dice with the universe. Imagination is more important than knowledge. For knowledge is limited to all we now know and understand, while imagination embraces the entire world, and all there ever will be to know and understand. The most incomprehensible thing about the world is that it is at all comprehensible. Only those who attempt the absurd can achieve the impossible. You can never solve a problem on the level on which it was created. I never think of the future, it comes soon enough. The only thing that you absolutely have to know, is the location of the library. What a sad arrow when it is easier to smash an atom than a prejudice. Reading, after a certain age, diverts the mind too much from its creative pursuits. Any man who reads too much and uses his own brain too little falls into lazy habits of thinking. Look deep into nature, and then you will understand everything better. Weakness of attitude becomes weakness of character. It has become appallingly obvious that our technology has exceeded our humanity. From the standpoint of daily life, however, there is one thing we do know, that we are here for the sake of each other, above all for those upon whose smile and well-being our own happiness depends, and also for the countless unknown souls with whose fate we are connected by a bond of sympathy. Many times a day I realize how much my own outer and inner life is built upon the labors of my fellow men, both living and dead, and how earnestly I must exert myself in order to give in return as much as I have received. Few people are capable of expressing with equanimity opinions which differ from the prejudices of their social environment. Most people are incapable of forming such opinions. A true genius admits that he or she knows nothing. Do not worry about your difficulties in mathematics. I can assure you mine are still greater. The hardest thing in the world to understand is the income tax. If I had an hour to solve a problem I'd spend 55 minutes thinking about the problem and 5 minutes thinking about solutions. If there is any religion that could respond to the needs of modern science, it would be Buddhism. If people are good only because they fear punishment, and hope for reward, then we are a sorry lot indeed. 
You cannot simultaneously prevent and prepare for war. Common sense is the collection of prejudices acquired by age 18. 